Welcome to this video on adding drama to your photos with Selective Color. Selective Color is a popular post-processing technique where the majority of an image is converted to black and white while some parts of the image are left in color. In this tutorial, we will show you how to use the Selective Color technique to add dramatic tone to a photo with PaintShop Pro. First, launch PaintShop Pro in the Edit Workspace and open the image that you'll be working with. Since this project uses multiple layers, you will need to have the Layers palette open for the remainder of this tutorial. To open the Layers palette, press the F8 key on your keyboard. Next, duplicate the background layer by going to the Layers menu and selecting Duplicate. I'll rename this layer to Black and White. Next, from the Effects menu, select Photo Effects and then Black and White Film. Set the brightness to minus 50 and the clarity to 50. Duplicate the black and white layer and rename the duplicate Vignette. Next, launch the Instant Effects palette by going to View Palettes, and then selecting Instant Effects. Apply the Instant Effect Vignette to this layer. Next, select the background layer and duplicate it again. This will create a copy of the background. Hold down the left mouse button and drag this layer to the top of the Layers palette. I'll rename this one Selective Color. From the Tools toolbar, choose the Smart Selection brush. Next, set the mode to Add. You can adjust the size to match the project that you're working on. This tool will quickly create a Smart Selection based on the sample brush stroke. Left-click over the areas of the image you want to select and the selection will automatically expand to the edges. As you can see, if I click around this area, it will automatically recognize that the dress is different from the background. When you have the bulk of your subject selected, you can use some of the other selection tools to get further details. From the Selections menu, click on Invert Selection, and then hit the Delete key on your keyboard. This will remove everything but the main subject and final touch-ups can be done with the eraser tool. To add an additional soft, vibrant light to the subject, duplicate the selective color layer, and then change the blend mode of the duplicate to soft light. If the color is a bit too vibrant, you can adjust the opacity of the layer. When the project is complete, it's important to save a version as a PaintShop Pro image file. This way, your layers will remain intact. From the File menu, click Save As, and then select PSP Image as the file type. Next, I will save a version that can be printed or shared online by going back to File, Save As, and selecting JPEG. When saving a multi-layer project as a JPEG file, you'll get a warning message and this is because JPEGs can only contain a single layer. Click Yes to this message to continue. Thank you for watching this video on adding drama with Selective Color.